Hey there, YouTube, it's Super Duke here. Coming to you guys today with part 7 of my Kingdom Hearts Let's Play. Now, in the last part, we fought the Trick Master and died like five times almost. Yeah, off screen in the last part, by the way, I ended up getting a bunch of potions, so if you see a bunch of new potions, that's why. Anyways, we can now go to the next world. So, however, before we go there, I'm going to go to the gummy garage. We got some gummy parts and stuff in the last episodes or whatever. I'm probably going to end up making the ugliest spaceship ever, but, um, yeah, it's going to be really ugly, but it's going to be very extremely efficient. Alright, anyway, so this is the gummy menu. If you look, you can see, like, a little rocket and a collect pit or whatever. Basically, these are the parts that you have, and it's easier to just kind of see than to just kind of, you know what I mean? You just put the parts down. And for some reason, it, I don't know why, the parts just work, basically, no matter what. I mean, not no matter what, you do have limits or whatever, but it doesn't have to be connected. So if you really want to do this, this is what I usually do. It makes the ship kind of slow sometimes, but um, it's oddly efficient that I um, just have random floating blocks everywhere. It looks really, really stupid, but it actually increases the defense of the ship by like a lot, so... Yeah, let's throw a bunch of random blocks down until we can't throw any more random blocks down. Oh yeah, random blocks for the win! Yeah. Let's do this. Okay. Do we have any guns? Oh, yeah, we have that Thunder G. Okay, go down. There you go. Good cannon. I don't think we have any more weapons. I think, yeah, that's all we have for the time being, but, uh, yeah. Let's save that. And that's our new ship, with a bunch of random floating crap everywhere. Um, in the future, I just wanted to show you guys for the first time that I'm probably going to be cutting the, um, random floating crap out, adding my random floating crap. I'll just cut that out and I'll let you guys know if I have anything important. For the most part, it's just going to be defensive upgrades, but if I had something new like a gun or whatever, I'll definitely let you guys know. So now, we shoot in three directions because of that Thunder G that we added. So this is super nice. Running up to the next world, we don't know what it is yet, though. So let's concentrate on getting there. Wow, I don't know how I can crash into any of that stuff. There we go, there's the crashes. Well, let's kill some of these dudes so I can get some health back that I probably shouldn't have lost. I only did so with my own stupidity. And not paying attention and crashing into stuff. Stop running into stuff. Anyways, um, while I'm here, I might as well apologize for the lack of uploads for the entire last half of um, this week. That's just, I kind of had a long week, and I just kind of didn't feel like recording, and I don't know, I just wasn't in a very good mood. So, yeah. Anyways, I don't think we saw this traveling to Wonderland. Um, once you get into certain places, not a really big deal, but sometimes the color changes. You might notice the color is changing. It's now... Eh, it's not a big deal, it's just kind of nice to little touch. You know what I mean? Flying through space, you all know that you see different colors when you're flying through space, right? I might actually die because I keep crashing into stupid stuff. I'm gonna kill some ships. Just call me hussy. But um, if you get that joke, you're a good cool dude, yo. Come on. I need some armor. Somebody say armor. Armor? No? Shell G? No, I want armor. There you go. You have to believe you can get armor from destroying these meteors. Armor basically is going to increase the gummy ship's quote unquote health, I guess. There we go. Anyways. I apologize for just kind of being kind of quiet. There's really not a lot you can say over Gummy Ship Rides, but, um... Hey, we... got there to the world. Hey, Donald, they're just talking. Mickey's down there somewhere. Eh, he's not there. But apparently Riku and Kyrie might be, so let's just go there. Ah, 
Donald, don't even be that guy. You promised that we would look for them too, and you're gonna say, no, we're not looking for them. We're landing. Apparently they're fighting over the control panel. That's generally not a good idea. Like, when somebody's dragging, it's like grabbing the wheel. You don't do that. Kevin Hart did a big rant on that. Not really a rant, but he's a comedian, and it was just kind of funny how he was talking about it, but... Yeah, let's crash land into this world. This is probably one of my more favorite worlds. I don't know, I like this world. Whoa. Unfortunately, this world never ever returns in any other Kingdom Hearts game. Due to copyright reasons, I guess. But it's a fun world while it's here. My head. Yeah, Donald? that did not look like a very good fall. Goofy? Whoa. <gasps> hey now. Hey now! Jaguars? Pull we'll the Jaguar in. Alrighty, okay, I see how you are. Let's throw down, it's a Jaguar. Let's throw down. Anyways, this is um, a fight, kind of like the fight with uh, Leon. It's difficult, but if you lose, you, the story progresses anyway, so. Anyways, uh. Fire works. Oh my gosh. Fire works particularly well in this deck just because you can smack it over and over and over again. Like. Okay, I missed all of them. And apparently it killed me with one hit from like half health. That was stupid. This is stupid. All of these optional fights, I am losing. I am losing all these optional fights and I don't know why. Like in my just personal playthrough, maybe just because I'm commentating, I win all these fights and I'm still playing on problem for my personal run through. I don't know why, I just keep losing these fights. Sabor. And apparently all my fire Danger. missed. Uh thank you. Sabor. Thank you. Uh, uh what is this place? This place this place. Okay. Where did the others go? Look. I got separated from my friends. Have you seen them? Mm -hmm. Friends. Friends. Right, my friends. There's two of them. The loud one is Donna. Uh -huh. You Ooh. know what? They Never just mind. got denied. Now the goofy. For my uh, friends. I feel like Riku he's taking out his rage on Goofy just for something that Donald did. Look. Oh, Riku. poor Goofy. Goof Goofy never Friends. does anything to hurt anybody unless right. it's a Heartless. Or Clarkson. Which you'll find out about that later. Uh, There's an enemy right. in a Chain of Memories, uh, which I do plan on playing on my channel at some point. Friend. He basically chucks yeah. a shield at her face. I'm like... Really? <laughs> 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 Threw it at her face. Huh? That was obscure. <laughs> Tarzan, Friend. you have quite the vernacular. Oh, jeez, oh, peez Not sure I but show me. Take me to Riku and Kairi. No, don't show Tarzan. him your e ooh, 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 uh. Tarzan, go. And I'm Sora. Tarzan, go. Sora, go, go. Sora, go, go. Yes. Anyways, um, we just met Tarzan. One of another, actually not another. That's probably one of my favorite Disney movies. My overall legitimate favorite Disney movie ever is definitely Lilo and Stitch. Oh my gosh, just uh, it's just so good. It's just so good. I love it. And it's funny. And she's obsessed with Elvis. That's hilarious. Like, your little cartoon oh, character obsessed with a real old person. Like, it's hilarious. Come on, guys. I sure hope Sora's okay. Ah! Who needs them? They can find the kid without them. Huh? Look, it's Rosie O'Donnell, monkey. Pretty sure Rosie O'Donnell played that monkey's voice, or gorilla, for you people who are super correct about everything. Oh, it pooped a gummy piece out. Oh no, it's a dude with a gun in Kingdom Hearts. I feel like if guns exist, they'd be very pretty effective for taking out Heartless. I mean, we know guns exist because Squall had the gun blade with him, but uh. I don't think I ever really used the gun part of it. Tarzan, where you be going? Tarzan. Tarzan, what you doing? Anyways, um, as I'm sure you guys realized, down on the Goofy are not with us currently, and we have Tarzan in our party. So, yes, we actually do get party members that are not Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Or, Sora's always in your party, but... You do have the option to replace Donald and Goofy in certain worlds. Like, Tarzan, he's not gonna follow with you. He's 
uh, exclusive for this world. Excuse me if my voice sounds a little bit weird. That's one you guys just kind of burp and it just kind of won't come out of some of those situations, you know? I'm gonna check to see if I actually equipped my. I was trying to make sure I had my items equipped, but. Yeah! Tarzan jumped down here. I guess if uh, Tarzan could survive it, we probably can't because we haven't been racing the jungle, but whatever. Anyways, yes. Tarzan is following us around, and let's save right quick. Anyways, um, I forgot to mention this world is called the Deep Jungle, and of course it's the Tarzan world. Anyways, um, yeah, there we had an interesting discussion about, um, Tarzan, like, why he doesn't have a beard. Tarzan appears to be, um, I don't know, I guess the, I don't know where the jungle is from, I'm assuming it's someplace in, uh, maybe Africa, I don't know if Africa has a lot of jungles, but, um, yeah, also, also, fine sliding, it's all just like Tarzan. And you can get hit by things, so just be careful when you're jumping and stuff. I don't know, you, I get hit a lot in this. It's not a big deal. I feel like you should get some kind of bonus if you do it without getting hit, but I haven't been without getting hit in a long time. And that's super annoying, because you can just jump over one, and then the other one will be waiting for you. Anyways, anyways we're having a discussion about why Tarzan, you know, doesn't... Yeah, why he doesn't have facial hair? He appears to be from uh, someplace in Europe because he does have a more Caucasian skin tone. I don't know. Caucasians kind of... Yeah, I mean, look how long the hair on his head is. So, it's not like he doesn't have hair. We're going to collect all these lives, by the way. So, I mean, okay. It's clear that he hasn't gotten a haircut because his hair is so long. So, it's like, why doesn't he grow hair anywhere else except for the top of his head? Uh, I remember we were, I was talking to my... Uh, friend James about this, and I think it was James who said this, he was like, yeah, he grows to other places, that's not a loincloth he's wearing, I'm like, ew, <laughs> but, um, yeah, yeah, I feel like he, he doesn't have an opportunity to shave, so why wouldn't he have facial hair? Tarzan, you so silly. Oh, look, it's the Beauty and the Beast tea set. I believe that that's... All the slides? Nope, there's one back here. Anyways, yeah, um, I just kind of went ahead and collected them. We're going to have to collect them all at some point anyways, in the very near future. There's some little things we can do also while we're out here, like, uh, I guess, like, throw some potions and stuff, and I'm not really going to be doing all that, though. It's kind of pointless. But if you want to, feel free. You can, uh, look at all this stuff on the table, and this drawing, and you can basically, uh, synthesize items and, like, turn a potion into an ether or whatever. It's... Yeah. Kinda pointless. Jane. Tarzan. Oh, and who's this? Uh, hi there. I'm... Oh, you speak English. Yay, so, English. Um, obviously, you're not related to Tarzan. Yeah, the fact that Are he has clothes on. gorillas? Highly doubtful. So oh, you just sound so smug. Donald. <laughs> A circus of clowns. They're all but her. Not being but her. Gorillas. Mr. Clayton, we're studying them, not hunting them. This is research. Okay. By the way, that that picture in the background just proved okay. that they're in Africa currently. The more the merrier. Do make yourselves at home. But judging by her accent, they are from England, and I don't know where Tarzan's parents are from off the top of my head. Maybe also from England. Huh? So I don't look know. what we found. Look at this. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, we gotta work together. For now. Anyways, um. As much as I really do like Tarzan, there are a couple of trinities around, so I am gonna... Or are we gonna do this? Okay. Tarzan, replace with that. Okay, there we go. As much as I do like Tarzan, there are a couple of trinities around, so I am gonna just have the original trio for the time being. Just because I do want to pick up the trinities. I will go grab the trinities that I can currently, and then I will, uh 
probably grab Tarzan and replace Donald. Anyway, Tarzan was apparently raised by gorillas, so yeah, we're looking for our friends. We gotta talk to her. We'll see if Tarzan recognizes any of the slides, so that's why we have to go grab the slides. Some weird castle. Looks familiar somehow. That's weird. Man giving cool flowers. Uh, I don't even know what that is. A crew. A ship. Fencing. Well, Tazan? There's a lot of cutscenes. I apologize. Where are my friends, Riku and Kairi? Hey, I thought. That leaves just one place. <sighs> Young man, we've been in this jungle for some time now. But we have yet to encounter these friends of yours. By the by, I hope it's not going to anything, but that, uh, gorillas, but his name is Clayton, so I'm just going to refer to him as Clayton we because that is his name. Clayton. Oh, there they go. Then not a spoiler anymore. Them. Clayton. Take us to the gorillas. Gorillas. No oh, man, we can't be taken to the gorillas. They're sacred, man. Okay, awesome staring contest. Tarzan, I see that. No dialogue. Are you sure? Tarzan, go see Kerchak. Kerchak? He must be the leader. Perfect. <laughs> I'll go along as an escort. After all, the we don't need no escort. Play. I got a keyblade, and he has a spear, and a shield, and a magic wand. We don't need your little gun. Guns are stupid. Why well, have guns when you can beat stuff to death with a key? Oh my god! That's why you should have a gun. Oh my god. Okay, let's... Let's get up here, because he can't hit us up here, so let's... Heal real quick. Oh, okay, apparently he can almost get up there. Man, where did you just... You just popped out of nowhere. I mean, I know this thing has a random chance of kind of appearing in most rooms or whatever, but man, he doesn't usually appear the first time you walk out of the room. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you can get up here! Oh, okay, we beat him that time. This one is a bit weaker than the one that we ran into. He also gives you 30 experience when you beat him, the one we ran into at the very beginning of the episode. So he's basically kind of like Squall. Anyways, let's do this Trinity right quick. Boom, shakalaka. They're all looking around. Anyways, we do get a open thing. Dalmatians, we get a Dalmatians, yes. I am gonna equip some more items. Oh, I thought I had more items than I got in the, you know, just kind of exploring around Wonderland, but whatever, not a big deal. Alrighty, there we go, now we have this. Anyways, I'm, at the end of this world, we are gonna be getting a spell that's not gonna necessarily obsolete potions, but it's gonna be a lot more useful than potions. Hopefully I'm not really spoiling anything, but it's gonna be a, um, an ability that you see, I almost just said it out loud anyways, but... Yeah, anyways, uh, these thingies, my bobbies, these hippos, you can jump on them, they're basically platforms. So... Get... On the land. You probably notice, I can't... Oh, oh, here's this hippo, he goes underwater, so... If you land on the water, he's a nice little platform to use. Ah, the platforming in this game is not very good. Anyways, oh look, more A Dalmatians. Let's climb up this vein! Oh look, sorry progression. Kerchak, please listen to me! I know the nesting grounds are secret, but I trust them. You see, I want to help them because, because, well, they need us. Oh, did you get that? No! Kerchak! <laughs> it's implied that it's speaking gorilla there. Ooh, they just made it in English, so it's easy to understand. I'm trying to figure out how gorilla language that appears to be at least in Tarzan come uh, composed of mostly grunts and uh, 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 
I don't know how that translates to Kerchak in English somehow. I mean, basically here saying that uh, we can do some more vine swinging. Just hit jump next when you're at the end of one and you go to the next vine. And that's it. End of story. Pretty boring. I mean, it looks cool, but it's really not that fun. Literally all you do is just have X over and over again. I am gonna hop over here and grab this treasure chest real quick though. And... I need to get back over there. Oh, whoa, 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 okay, that was close. You gonna do that? You're gonna be that guy? No, cut, no, face the right way. Ready? Set. Okay, now jump next. There you go. Watch out for that tree. Wrong jungle person, dude, yo. Do I look like George the Jungle to you? Nah, man, I look like Sora. Um, hmm. There's really not a lot we can do with this current room at the for the time being, but uh, oh, yeah, I knew there was something here. That's, I had a sneaky suspicion that I was supposed to come here. I believe that there's um one more blue trinity in here, not in here, but um, just in this area. So then I. We'll have no problem switching back to Tarzan, you know, right after this, because I will basically have all the, um, all the trinities that I need, so I'm not going to need the original trio of Sora, Donald, and Goofy anymore. And what are you doing with that gun, man? Way to distract them, Donald. Run, Mr. Gorilla. Rosie O'Donnell, Gorilla. This is actually voiced by Rosanna Donald in this game. In fact, I think that yell was the only line they have in the entire game. And they didn't get they didn't get back any of the girls' voice actors, probably because, like I said, um, copyright reasons. Kerchak now distrusts Tarzan and his friends because Clayton tried to kill him. One of the gorillas, Rosie O'Donnell gorilla. I was only trying to. Ah, a snake slithered by. You see, I saved that poor gorilla's life. Wouldn't there be a snake corpse there, man? You are a terrible liar. You are just the worst of liars. Anyways, um, look up here. We can't get up here just yet. For the part, most part, we're going to be returning to a lot of the earlier worlds once we get farther in the game, so we can just kind of explore more, get some more treasure. So yeah, I... I guess I'll try to make this 100% run, even though there's a lot of stuff that I kind of don't want to do just yet, but... Yeah, let's hop right back down here. This is where the last Trinity was. Are you going to do this, Sora? Are you going to be... Stop that! There. Thank you. Was that that hard? Anyways, the, um... Last Trinity was in here, I believe. No, 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 no. Don't fall down yet. Dang it. Oh, my gosh. Screw it. Let's see if I can do this without getting hit, though. Okay. 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 And here comes the two thick branches. Okay. Oh. Oh. I did it! Yay! Yay! I gained nothing from that! I are the best! I are the best around! I always sing the song whenever it pops up in my head. What was that? Don't tell me this is the is back. Oh, come on! Why are there so many spores here, yo? Oh my god! So much damage! Hit him! Okay, there we go. And I just totally remembered something that I should have remembered a long time ago. We got an experience. We got an uh, when we got an upgrade or a level or whatever in the last episode. We got some uh, bonus points. Oh no, we didn't. I thought. Okay, I already equipped Slapshot. Oopsies. Speaking of, do we have any? We need to equip uh, abilities on Donald and Goofy. Let's make them more useful, right? 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 Yeah, Berserk Donald's always at low HP. Yeah, 
I think, I don't know if I missed a training there. I'll go get it at some point in the next episode if I did. But, um, I am going to switch down with up for now. How could you do such a thing? Because this is going to be a lot of combat coming up, and I want to show Tarzan off in combat, and he is a beast in combat, quite literally. He is a just a gorilla. Because of one mishap, come now. They just look so hood right now. I know they're from Africa, but Jesus, man, you got to be that ghetto. Huh. Just kidding. Racism isn't cool. Being black does not justify racist comments, and I am black, just so you know. Racist comments are not fun. I am not an advocate for racism. Racism is bad. I'll stake my life on it. Oh man, I just thought of something. I don't know how many of you guys are a fan of Game Grumps, but um, it's basically a channel between um, currently it's between two people um, called Aaron and Danny, and their YouTube channels are Ego Raptor and Ninja Sex Party, but um. Yeah, they had this one episode, um, uh, they were playing a game called, uh, Super Tennis or whatever, and they were making up a character called the Racist Bassist, and he was just, like, a member of the KKK, and he was, and he also played the bass, and he would just say, like, racist things, like, it was a game about tennis, so he was like, double fault? That sounds like something that a black person would say. Ba-doom, doom, 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 and basically, he just, he makes a racist comment and then plays a bass line, and it's just, it was pretty funny, and, you know, I don't know. Anyways, I am going to switch Tarzan into my party and replace Donald. And I will, um... Yeah, we will continue going outside next time on Game Grumps. No, I'm kidding. Uh, no, but seriously, um, I am going to not the part here. So I will see you guys all later. I really hope you guys enjoyed this part. Drop a comment, a like, and a subscribe. I have a Facebook and a Tumblr if you guys want to follow my personal life down on um, in the description. So I'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye.